Hi friends, I have a special art project for us today. Today, we're going to make a bottle that will help us calm down whenever we feel worried or mad or anxious or just like, you know what I mean? Sometimes you need help calming down. So today, I'm gonna to show you how to make a bottle that'll help you do that. And even if you can't make it with me today, let's just be together. Cause sometimes being with a good friend can help <sighs> calm down. You ready? Let's go. Welcome to the studio. Today, we're going to be making one of these amazing bottles together. I'll show you how this bottle helps me relax at the end of the video. Here's what you need. A clear container, corn syrup, liquid watercolor or food coloring, glitter, glitter glue if you want, and super glue or hot glue. This is for the grown-ups. You're also going to need some hot water and I would recommend a measuring cup that can go in the microwave. The first thing we're gonna add is corn syrup. If you don't have corn syrup at home, that's fine. You can use clear glue. Corn syrup is very sticky and very thick. Watch. I'm gonna pour my corn syrup in this measuring cup first because it's a little easier to pour when you heat it up. <laughs> oh my. I'm gonna go warm this up and um, wash my hands. I'll be right back. I'm back. I put my corn syrup in the microwave for about a minute. See, it's much easier to pour now. The next step is to add food coloring or liquid watercolor to our corn syrup. I'm going to use blue for my bottle. I'm gonna add one, two, three drops. If you want more color, add more color. All right, let's stir it up. beautiful already. Once your color is mixed into your corn syrup, pour it into your bottle. Next, I'm going to add my glitter. I'm gonna use one small tube of glitter glue. Then I'm going to add my dry glitter. I'm gonna make a funnel for the top of my bottle so that the glitter doesn't go everywhere when I try to pour it in. I just folded a post-it note and funnel. You can add as much or as little glitter as you want. It's fun to have your glitter be different sizes so that it sinks and floats all at different times. Now I'm gonna add a little white. That reminds me of snow. Perfect. Now I'm gonna add warm water to fill up the rest of my bottle. I'm gonna dye my water before I add it to the bottle. Again, I'm using liquid watercolor. You can also use food dye. When you're making art, it's important sometimes not to be in such a hurry. It's not just about the bottle we're making. It's about every part of enjoying how things smell and feel and look. Look how beautiful this is when you drop it in and let it dance in the water. After you're done enjoying how this looks in the water, you can stir it up. That part's pretty fun too. We're just gonna fill up our bottle. 
We're almost done. Perfect. You want to fill it most of the way up, but leave a little bit of the space on top so that the glitter and water has room to move around. Now we're going to stir up all of the things we put in the bottle. We want our glitter to get in the corn syrup. We want the water to get in the glitter. We want the corn syrup to get in the water. Mostly you want to break up any big chunks of glitter that you put in because the next step is going to help mix it up too. We're going to put our cap on. really tight and give it a shake. The bottle still feels warm in my hands because the corn syrup and the water were warm. Okay, now we get to decide if we want to add any more color or glitter or anything else to our bottle. I think it looks awesome. Once you've decided that this is how you want your bottle, you're going to take off the top, put super glue all the way around the edge. And put on your top for the last time. My favorite way to use this bottle when I'm trying to calm down is to imagine that this bottle is like how I feel. So if I feel really stressed out or really worried, I shake it up. And then I imagine that all of that glitter swirling around is like all of the thoughts and energy swirling around in my head. And I put it down. And I watch it. I watch it as the glitter settles as it slows down. And I imagine all of those thoughts and feelings <sighs> sinking, 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 until I can just hold them calmly in my hand. Sometimes I just try to be very still until all of the glitter settles. And then at the end of that, I usually feel a little bit better. hoped you like making this bottle with me in the studio today. I loved having you in the studio today. If you end up making a bottle like this or anything that we've made together in the studio yourself at home or at school, will you show it to me? I'd love to see it. I'm on Instagram and Facebook and you can tag me or use the hashtag Kylie makes it so I can see it. I can't wait to see what you make. Also, if you like this kind of art, art projects that help you calm down, there's more coming. Go to KylieMakesIt.com and subscribe to my channel and my Instagram and Facebook, whatever you use, to stay up to date on the next project. Remember friends, we're going to make it. See you soon.